We're here just outside Centum Home Lenders with Clinton and oh my goodness, the talk have been amongst my friends buying a home. It's been crazy really, hasn't it? The market, I've seen so many for sale signs, sold signs. Mm -hmm. There's been so much talk about, you know, when is a good time to buy a home? Would you say now going into the fall after you know this hot streak in the summer would be a good idea? Well, right now it is a seller's market. Okay. And I think the fall is a great time to buy. Um, you know, normally we talk about the spring market and going to the summer being very busy, but I think the fall of this year is very interesting. One, I think things are more delayed. So okay. I think there's gonna definitely be more transactions happening in the fall. But I also think that you know, people who are wanting to buy in the fall, um, you know, sellers are going to become more motivated. Yeah. They are going to want to sell their homes before the winter comes. Okay. You know, if you think, if, just think, if you own a home yeah. and you really want to sell it, let's say it's vacant and you've already bought another place, so you're yeah. just trying to sell the second home that you have, you may not want to shovel the snow, yes. keep the property, maintain it all winter long. So I, I, I find that the fall, usually mm. sellers are a little bit more willing to negotiate. Okay. And I think, you know, it's a great time to, you know, buy. That is my next question because there are so many homes. It is a buyer's, um, a seller's market rather. How do you know what to go in with with your price, your negotiations, uh, especially when you know there's so much competition? I know. Well, I think the first place to start is with a pre-approval. So I think seeking the advice of an unbiased mortgage professional like me is super, super important. It's very competitive out there. And you know, if you come in with a really solid pre-approval, I think that you'll have uh, you know, a head start compared to maybe some other buyers. Yeah. But it's also knowing what you can afford, which yes. is so, so important. You don't wanna make an offer and get something accepted by a seller and then learn that you you know, you know, can't close on that transaction because you can't secure that mortgage yeah. financing. So I think having the pre-approval is super important. And then once you've been in to be pre-approved with us or in, you know, another unbiased mortgage professional, I think you know, seeking the advice of a realtor is so important. I think having a realtor on your side yeah. is really, really key. So when someone's selling their home, you know, they'll get a realtor and they'll have a listing agent. Um, and, you know, as a buyer, you can use a realtor and that's paid by the seller. So there's no cost to you. So I think, you know, having a realtor that's on your side is really important as well. Wow, that is very, very good information because it can be so overwhelming. <laughs> totally. And I think that it's even more overwhelming right now just with how many challenges there are even with 2020 yes. and with the market here in Halifax and really across Atlantic Canada, it has been very busy. But have interest rates gone down? Interest rates are at historic lows, which I think is very interesting. Oh. It's great okay. for people who are buying, but it's great for existing homeowners. You know, it's a great time to look at maybe an early renewal or potentially a refinance because the rates are at historic lows. So it could make sense breaking your existing term early yeah. and getting into something that's lower because you know right now rates have never been lower and chances are, at least in our lifetime, Anna, we're never going to be able to borrow money as cheap as we can borrow oh, right now. Oh, really? Yeah. And so if we have any questions, you would be the great guy to Yeah, you can us. certainly check us out online. Okay. I think, you know, checking us out at teamclinton.ca is great. Yeah. Or visit another unbiased mortgage professional in your area. So, okay, and for somebody who is thinking about buying a home, this is their first time, they're excited, mm -hmm. what is the biggest piece of advice you would give to them? Especially, <laughs> we're living through a pandemic. It is overwhelming, to say the least. Well, I think just knowing what you can afford is important. You know, we will look at assets, income, and credit and you know just have all your documents together sometimes okay. you know that's the biggest challenge yeah uh, you know know where your documents are and then get that pre-approval and just start that planning prepping process so when you come in and talk to you you're set to go well it's the biggest purchase of your life and the mortgage is your biggest <laughs> debt so you really want to have someone like us on your side oh my gosh when you put it in that way yeah it is okay very good thank you so much when i really appreciate thanks it. thanks for having us